Hi guys, welcome back. It has been a little while, but things are going really well. I have a lot of really fun things to share with you today. But before we hop into all of that, I just want to mention that today's video is sponsored by Factor. Let me just give you a really quick overview as to why I love Factor so much. All right, so as you guys know, I've been keto for a while now. Since November, I've lost a total of 90 pounds now. And a lot of it has got to do with my pre-made factor meals. I absolutely love my pre-made keto meals. Now, factor is amazing because they offer tons of different kinds of dietary preferences. Healthy eating made simple, and I mean it. It's like toss it in the microwave, and it is the most delicious meal. The best part about factor is that you can choose which meals you want, and they have a different menu every single week based on your taste preferences, your dietary preferences, etc. Like I said. Said, I am keto so I like to go with their keto meal plan and let me show you what these guys look like I love my factor meals so much they this is my second shipment that I've gotten in and I devoured my first one so let me share just a couple of things that I've really loved about them okay so the first thing obviously is how easy it is for me to heat up my meals I typically use these for my lunches or if the kids are like craving spaghetti or ramen noodles or something for dinner, then I will just heat one of these bad boys up. So you can heat these bad boys up in the microwave or in the oven, it is completely up to you. And the best part for me is sometimes when I'm feeling a little snacky at night, I might even heat one of these bad boys up and then I know I'm not going to be falling off track with my macros because I'll tell you what, I am a snacker and I love the factor keeps me on track with my weight loss. Let's dig into some of these amazing meals that they sent me for this week. Again, I could go on and on about the reasons why I love Factor, but trust me, in a world of unrealistic diet plans, Factor is such a fresh breath of air for me because it's exactly what I'm looking for. The meals are always so filling and they're all keto friendly. So again, I don't break out of my macros. And for me, Factor meals are definitely a healthier, guilt-free version of doing takeout or delivery because your homegirl loves her home delivery and her takeout, okay? Um, and these save me every time and save me a ton of money. I love it. So just an example of some other dietary preferences that they do. They do low carb, low calorie, they'll do keto, high protein, plant-based, dairy-free, the list goes on. So trust me, Factor's got the meals that you need to save yourself a buck and make sure that you stay on track with your weight loss goals. So um, this week, what I got from Factor, I'm, oh, I'm so pumped. So the first one is ricotta meatballs with zucchini noodles. I love the packaging. I love the black and white cute logo. Um, so come on, how do we not? Oh my gosh, I have been craving spaghetti so often lately when the kids have been craving it. So this is going to come in handy. <laughs> Um, this is the keto chorizo chili. Okay, so chorizo, I love chorizo, I love chili. So this is like the perfect combo and I love how they separate out their like sauces. So this I believe is sour cream. They've got some fresh shredded cheese in here. This looks amazing. I'm probably going to eat this one first if I'm being honest. I will show you guys what that looks like here in a minute. Heat it up. Um, this is a keto poblano bowl and I did try this one last time. It is so good. Um, I love the little sauce here. Um, and here's your meat. I also got grilled pork chop with red pepper, collie mash. Okay, let's come on you guys. Okay, I need to get close for this one. It is like, oh my gosh. Okay, sorry, my window. Um, the red pepper collie mash on the bottom. Look at the grill marks on that chicken. Oh, and then I also got the creamy Parmesan chicken with roasted broccoli. You can't go wrong. Oh, that looks so good. There's a, a little like pad of butter in there as well. So when you heat it up, oh, yummy. And all of the heating instructions are on the back for you. Super simple, laid out. All of your nutrition facts are on the back so that you can easily input it into whatever kind of um, like calorie tracker or fitness um, like food tracker that you are using. Um, another thing I wanted to mention, grass-fed, pasture-raised meat, antibiotic and hormone-free, no refined sugars, preservative-free and non-GMO. Can't get any better than that. So like I said, I want to show you guys what this looks like when it's all heated up and I can't wait to dive into this chili. It's gonna be so good. So the instructions for this bad boy says you need to take the sour cream out, so I'm gonna do that first. And then it says to sprinkle the shredded cheese over the chili, so I'm going to do that. 
So hold one minute while I swatch. Okay, beautiful. And then I'm just going to cover it. And I like to either transfer this to a bowl afterwards or what I like to do is just eat it right out of here save some dishes you know mama doesn't want to do any more dishes so you can eat it right out of the container as well so i'm gonna go ahead and heat this up according to the instructions high on two minutes um, and then if needed heat an additional 30 seconds until desired temperature is reached yeah okay let's go heat this up okay so while that heats up i'm just gonna give you guys a quick weight loss update so 90 pounds like i mentioned and i'm ecstatic um i've kind of gone up like up and down these last five pounds just because i just got back from vacation and i had my time of the month as a female it was wonderful um but i gained a little bit of weight and i've just been kind of bouncing up and down but i am at like 90 pounds so it's like 90.4 pounds crazy um and this is what i'm looking like i always like my house is always so cold during the day but i love it cold at night when i'm sleeping so um i'm always wearing an oversized tee but um as a friend, and i'm always wearing biker shorts the biggest area that i've seen weight loss in the past couple months has definitely been my hips and my thighs <laughs> my thighs um so that is an update for you guys as far as like my weight loss you can never tell because i'm always wearing these oversized tees and sweatshirts but that is how we're doing and again thanks to factor i'm able to stay on my keto track even when i feel like ordering all of the takeout and all of the delivery it keeps me on track so all right i'm gonna go check on this food mix it up a little bit and then show you guys what it looks like okay come on tell me this does not look so good cheesy I can smell the trees. Oh my God, it smells so good. I love chili so much. Okay. Oh my God. I have um in my mouth. Okay, and I just need to show you guys. There's like chive in the sour cream. Okay, that's like next level. So good, sour cream and chive. Oh my God, this is so good. I am so hungry right now and I really want this just to get in my belly. I'm not gonna be a pig and eat this whole thing on camera. Or maybe, I don't know. Mm. You guys, it's so good. Okay, if you want $90 off, your first three orders, free shipping, make sure that you use my code in the link down below in my description box. Again, I promise you will not regret it. Factor meals are my most favorite keto prepped meals by far. They are incredible. Go and check them out. Makes life so much easier, especially with school starting for the kiddos this fall and going back to work, which I have some news on that. Um, yes, very highly recommend. Thank you to Factor again for sponsoring today's video. Okay, so today is Mommy Kaya Day. It's Wednesday, so Riker goes to daycare. Kaya stays home with me. I've been doing a ton of prep work. I don't know if any of you guys are like this, but I went out to Target this morning. I got all of the planning supplies. Um, I really want to go into detail as to like how I stay organized in, an, uh, in another video because it's like a love language for me. I love new pens and all of the new like notebooks, a fresh notebook, Mwah, chef's kiss. It's so good. So anyways, okay, I need to take another bite of this. It's seriously so good. Mm, excuse me. So as you guys can see on my channel, I've been gone for a hot minute. I've been taking the summer, I've been enjoying, it has been amazing. I have been all over the place, I've been traveling, I've been going to the lakes. It is, it has honestly been like the most amazing summer. But we've got some huge life changes coming. And I don't like saying that without telling you guys like the whole thing, the whole story. So what I can tell you right now is I've officially accepted a job offer for an amazing position. So the reason why I am doing this, there's two reasons. And I talked about this over on my Instagram. I wanna to touch base on it again for those of you who maybe don't follow me on Instagram. So here's your YouTube video giving you all of the life updates. So yes, I accepted a fully remote position. I work from home, it is an accounting position for an amazing company. Small family owned property management company based out of Oregon, amazing. And I feel so lucky that I was a, bless you, that, I was, that they found me. I, I'm just, I'm, I feel so incredibly blessed. And for I've already met with them a couple of times via Zoom and I love them. So the reason why I'm doing this, there's two reasons. First off, my kids are going back to school. I've been 
out of my work field for the past year or so, a, a little over a year for those of you who have been following me um, throughout this whole journey. Um, so the kids are going back to school and, yeah. or Ken, or Kenna. So Kaya is starting kindergarten and Riker is starting preschool. So the kids are gonna be gone during the day and I just, I need something to fill my time. With the kids going back to school, I just needed something to fill up my time a little bit more. And we have made the decision to stop making M&M Rustics orders. So for the past year, I have been managing our M&M Rustics business from home. Um, like all of the bookkeeping, accounting, doing the marketing, the sales, like customer relations, everything I've been trying to handle that while being a stay at home mom and trying to do YouTube all at the same time. And I just found with me staying at home, I don't know how other YouTube moms do it. I really don't. And you guys know that I recently chose to not share as much of my kids in the videos anymore. Um, that's just personal choice, um, keeping them in their life private, but trying to share what it looks like as a mom, right? A day in the life of me and doing like clothing hauls and all of the things. I've gone over this before, but just really focusing it in on me and my day-to-day -day activities as a mom, working mom. Um, so with all of that and trying to film while I've been home ha with the kids has been so hard. Um, with them going back to school, yes, it makes it easier for me to film, but, but here's the deal is we are going to be taking out a significant amount of income, if I'm being honest, um, from stopping M&M Rustics orders. We're not stopping M&M Rustics overall, and we're not entirely stopping orders. We're taking one or two a month here and there, but we're really trying to step into that transition that I have talked about before, that we have so, so, so badly wanted to do and start many times, which is us doing videos and DIYs and renovations. Now, we have a huge amount of projects coming up over the winter, and we are redoing our camper over the winter so that it's more of a boho feel, and we are finishing all of the renovations in the house over the winter. And we wanna share all of that on YouTube, and we really wanted to clear our schedules and make time for that on the weekends and at night because that is what Mike and I do. So that's like our love language together is like doing renovations and projects. We love it so much. I love the designing aspect. He loves the construction aspect. It's a, it's a duo made in heaven. It works perfectly, but we don't have any time to focus in on those videos, etc. when we are doing so much for orders. We're slaving away in the garage. It is really difficult for us to get away. That is why I have decided to go back to work because I have a lot of free time, like I said, with the kids going to school. And I'm just, I'm so excited. I am, I feel so blessed to have found this amazing opportunity for myself and for my family. I can work from home and I work Monday through Friday, eight to five. But anyways, now I can share all of the working mom day in the life videos and giving you guys all of the routine videos. I know a lot of you came here in the beginning because you wanted to see what it looks like for a working mom. And yes, I'm not working in an office, but I have my home office set up. I have a dual screen set up, but I actually just ordered a new screen because I am going to be moving the other computer over to Mike so he can work on editing videos for Eminem Rustics. Um, so I have a new iMac coming and I'm gonna show you guys my entire setup because again, office stuff and like calendars, one of my love languages, like 100%. But that is the big news, is I have been job hunting and I have officially accepted an offer and I start next Monday and I couldn't be more excited. I thrive working from home and yes, my kids will be here until September 1st. They will still be in the house um, until school starts. So it will be a little bit of a juggle, a balance, and I will share all of my tips and tricks with you guys. It is a little bit different since I'm working a traditional eight to five, um, but for my home um, versus like working for myself um, and doing like our side hustles and some of our own like self-employment stuff that we've been doing throughout the past year um, to kind of float our finances right so I could stay home with the kids and really thoroughly enjoy that time with them so that is the big news I am super excited there is another huge announcement coming which I feel so bad but I just, I have to put it out there. I have to put it out in the universe that something really big is brewing, something big is happening, and 
me getting this job is just part of it. So I am very, very excited for all of the things coming in the future. And I will be back in a couple of days for my travel vlog from Colorado. I'm finally, finally sitting down and editing all of my videos and getting to comments, etc. I have been off YouTube for a few weeks, which can I just say that everybody needs a break from their work sometimes, even if their work, right, is mostly fun stuff, okay? I love editing videos. It is like one of my biggest hobbies. Travel them. So, here on my channel, I just took another bite of my chili. Mm. Here on my channel, I'm gonna be sharing, I've got um, a pretty large, now that we're getting into August, I am jumping fully back into my YouTube channel. I will be uploading once or twice a week on my personal channel, more so vlogs, hauls, things like that. And then, over on the at home channel, we are gearing up for all of the holidays and I am so excited. We will have one video over there every Friday for you guys. And like I said, lots of really fun stuff coming up. If you missed the backyard makeover or the yard makeover video that I uploaded last week, be sure that you guys go over there and check that video out because I put a lot of time into it. It is literally like several months worth of footage all compiled together showing you guys the transformation of our yard and kind of going over some of the fun things that we did. Um, but yeah, that is going to be the schedule. And I do have a school supply haul coming up. I've been gathering school supplies for a while now. And I, of course, it's my first going to kindergarten. So it's a big deal for me. It's a big deal for Kai. It's a big deal for Mike. So we are doing a little above and beyond for some of the things, but that's okay. And then in a, another video, I plan on doing an office supply haul for my since I am now going back to a more traditional job if you will I did do a restock on a lot of like my office supplies such as like manila folders um, pens everything that I could come up with an excuse that I needed for a new office but that's what's going on guys that's what's going on and I'm really excited for all of the content that's gonna be coming your way Thank you for being patient with me and sticking with me while I've been on this break. It has been much needed and I've had a lot of time to really focus in on my job searching and to sort some big life things out. So on that note, I will see you guys in a couple of days for that Colorado travel vlog and I'll see you next week for a day in the life of a working mom. Okay, bye guys.